Today I'm going to show you how to do the totem pole pattern. I'll be demonstrating this pattern on the My Friendship Bracelet Maker clipboard. For the totem pole pattern, you're going to choose four different colors. I chose purple, orange, green, and blue. Align your strings together, fold them in half to form a loop, and tie a knot about a half inch from the top of the loop. Pull your knot tight to form your loop, as you can see here. The loop is what you're going to secure under your peace sign clip. For this particular pattern, you're going to put your purple strands in slots number 9 and number 2. Orange will be in slots 3 and number 8. Green will be in slots 4 and 7. And your two blue strands will go into slots 5 and 6. To begin, you're going to make an arrow with your purple strands. You're going to make a right hand double knot on your orange strand, pull through once, twice, put the orange strand into slot two, pick up your number four, make your second right hand double knot with the green strand, place that into number three, pick up string number five which is blue, make another right hand double knot, place the blue strand into slot four and your purple strand into slot five. Now you're going to take number nine to continue the arrow and work backwards in. Make a left hand double knot with the orange strand, put that into slot nine, pick up the green, make another left hand double knot, pull that through twice, put that green into number eight, pick up number six which is blue, make another left hand double knot, that blue strand into number seven, and now you're going to join your center two strands to complete your arrow with a right hand double knot. Now we're going to make an orange arrow. Take string number two and your string number three, make a right hand double knot. Make your number four, pull through once, your number four, pull through a second time. Place your green strand in slot number two, pick up number four, which is blue. Make your number four, pull through once, second time. Place the blue string in slot three, pick up number five, which is purple. Pull through once, twice. Put your purple strand in slot four, your orange strand into slot five. Now you're going to pick up number nine and make a left hand double knot or a backwards four. Pull through once, twice, put the green string into slot nine, pick up number seven which is blue, again make your backwards four, pull through once, twice, put the blue strand into slot number eight, pick up number six which is purple, again make your left hand double knot or your backwards four, pull through once twice, put your purple strand into slot seven. And now you're going to join your center two strands with a right hand double knot. Pull through once, twice, and place your orange strings into number five and six. Now you're going to make an arrow again with your green strands. Make your right hand double knot, pull through once, twice, the blue strand will go in slot two, pick up number four which is purple, pull through once, twice, pick up number five which is orange, make your third right hand double knot here, put the orange string into number four, green into number five. Now you're going to pick up number nine, make a left hand double knot with the blue string from number eight, put the blue into number nine, pick up the purple, make your second left hand double knot, purple string into number eight, pick up number six which is orange, make another left hand double knot, put the orange string into number seven and join your center two strands with a right hand double knot. And that will complete your green arrow. Now you're going to make a blue arrow. Take number two, make a right hand double knot with string number three which is purple, put that purple string into slot two, pick up number four which is orange, make another right hand double knot orange string in number three, pick up number five which is green, 
Make another right hand double knot. Put that green string into number four, blue into number five. Now you continue your arrow, take number nine, make a left hand double knot with the purple from number eight. Put the purple strand into number nine, pick up seven, which is orange. Make another left hand double knot. Put the orange into number eight, pick up number six, which is green. Make another left hand double knot. Green strand into seven and join your center two strands with a right hand double knot. This will complete your blue arrow. Now you're gonna make another arrow with your purple strands and this is gonna be the start of your totem pole pattern. So make your right hand double knot with the orange strand from number three, place it into slot two. Pick up the green from number four, make another right hand double knot. Place that green into number three, pick up number five, which is blue. Make another right hand double knot. Put the blue into number four, purple into number five. Pick up the purple from number nine, Make a left hand double knot with string eight, which is orange. Place that orange string into number nine. Pick up number seven, which is green. Make another left hand double knot. Place that green string into number eight. Pick up number six, which is blue. Make another left hand double knot. Place the blue string into number seven. Pick up your purple strings and make a right hand double knot to complete your arrow. Now what you're gonna do is take string number two, which is orange, and make two right hand double knots. One with string three, which is green. Pull through once, twice. Place the green string in number two, pick up number four, and make your second right hand double knot. Blue string will go into slot three, orange string into slot four. Now you're gonna take string two, which will be green now, and make a right hand double knot with string number three, which is blue. Pull through once, twice, blue string will go into slot two, green string into slot three. Now you're gonna take string four, which is orange, and make two left hand double knots. First one with the green string from slot number three, pull through once, twice, green string will go in slot four, pick up number two, which is blue, and make another left hand double knot. Put your blue string into number three, orange string into number two. Now you're gonna take string number five, which is purple, and make three left hand double knots. One with string four, which is green. Place that green string in slot number five. Make your second left hand double knot with your blue string from slot three. Place that blue string in number four. Pick up number two, which is orange, and make your third left hand double knot. The orange string will go in slot three your purple string in slot number two. Now you're gonna move to the opposite side and take string number nine, which is orange, and make two left hand double knots. One with string eight, which is green. Green string will go in slot nine. Make your second left hand double knot with string number seven, which is blue. Blue string will go in slot eight, orange string in slot seven. Now you're gonna take the green string from slot number nine and make a left hand double knot with the blue string from slot number eight. Put the blue string in slot nine, green string in slot eight. Now you're gonna take your orange string from slot number seven and make two right hand double knots. One with string number eight, which is green, pull through once, twice, green string on slot seven, pick up number nine, which is blue, and make your second right hand double knot. Blue string will go in slot eight, orange string in slot nine. Now you're gonna take string number six, which is purple, and make three right hand double knots. One with string seven, which is green, pull through once, twice. Green string will go in slot six, pick up number eight, which is blue, pull through once, twice. Blue string in slot seven, Pick up number nine, which is orange, and make your third right hand double knot. Orange string will go in slot eight, purple string in slot nine. Now we're gonna close the center of your open diamond shape. You're gonna wanna take your purple string from slot number two and make three right hand double knots. You're not gonna wanna pull these too tight or else your 
opening will close. Pull through once, twice, orange string in slot two, pick up number four, which is blue, pull through once, not too tight, second time, blue string into slot number three, pick up number five, which is green, pull through once, twice, green string will be in slot four, purple string in slot five, and you can notice there's a little gap here between the strands. Now you're gonna take number nine, which is purple, and you're gonna make three left-hand double knots. Once with number eight, which is orange. Pull through the second time, the orange will go on number nine. Pick up number seven, which is blue. Pull through once, twice. Remember to make these kind of loose. Put the blue string on number eight. Pick up number six, which is green. Pull through once, twice. Put the green string in number seven. Now you're gonna join your center two strands with a right hand double knot. Pull through once, twice, and those two strands will go back in slots five and six. And you can see that the diamond here now is closed. Now you're gonna make an arrow with your orange strands. So you're gonna make a right hand double knot with the blue from slot number three. Another right hand double knot with string number four, which is green. Put that into slot three, pick up number five, which is purple. Another right hand double knot. Put the purple strand in slot four, your orange in slot five. Now you're gonna work your arrow back to the center. Take your green, excuse me, take your orange string number nine. Make a left hand double knot with the blue strand from number eight. Place the blue in number nine. Make your second left hand double knot on your green string from number seven. Place that green string in slot eight. Pick up number six, which is purple. Make another left hand double knot. Place that purple string in slot seven. Now you're gonna join your center strands five and six with a right hand double knot, and this will make your arrow. Now what you're gonna do is take string number two which is blue, and make two right hand double knots. Once with the green string from slot three, pull through the second time there, green string in slot two, pick up number four, make your second right hand double knot. Purple string in slot three, blue string will go into slot four. Now you're gonna take string two, which is green, and make one right hand double knot with string number three, which is purple. Purple string will go in slot two, green string and slot three. Now you're gonna take the blue string from slot number four and make two left hand double knots. One with the string from slot three, which is green. Put that green string into number four. Pick up number two, which is purple, and make your second left hand double knot. Purple string into slot three. Blue string into slot two. Now you're gonna take your orange string from slot number five and make three left hand double knots. One with the green string from slot number four. Pull through once, twice. Green string will go into slot five. Pick up number three. Make your second left hand double knot. Pull through the second time there. Purple into number four. Pick up number two, which is blue. Make your third left hand double knot. Blue string will go in slot three orange string into slot two. Now you're gonna move to the other side, take string nine, which is blue, and make two left hand double knots. One with a green string from slot eight. Put that green string into slot nine. Pick up number seven, which is purple. Make your second left hand double knot. Your purple string will go into slot eight, blue string into slot seven. Now you're gonna take the green string from slot nine and make a left hand double knot with string eight, which is purple. Purple string will go into slot nine, green string into slot eight. Now you're gonna take the blue string from slot seven and make two right hand double knots. First one with string eight, which is green. Place that into slot seven. Pick up number nine, which is purple. And make your second right hand double knot. Purple string will go into slot eight, blue string into slot nine. 
Now you're going to take the orange string from slot six and make three right hand double knots. One with string seven, which is green. Place that into slot six. Pick up number eight, which is purple. Make your second right hand double knot. Place that into slot seven. Pick up the blue from number nine. Make your third right hand double knot. Blue strand will go into slot eight. Orange strand into slot nine. Now we're going to close your diamond shape again. You're going to take your orange string from slot number two and make three right hand double knots. First one with string three, which is blue. Place that into number two. Pick up number four, which is purple. Remember, don't make this one too tight. Pull through once, twice. Purple string into number three. Pick up number five. Same thing, another right hand double knot. Pull through once, twice. Green into number four, orange into number five. Now you're gonna go on the other side and do the same thing, except backwards. You're gonna make a left hand double knot with number eight, which is blue. Place that into number nine. Pick up the purple, make your second left hand double knot. Through once, twice. Purple goes into number eight. Pick up the green from number six. Make your third, remember not too tight. Left hand double knot, green goes into seven. Now you're gonna join your two center strands, number five and six, which are, should both be orange close your diamond shape and place those strands back into five and six. Now you're going to make an arrow with the blue strands. So make a right hand double knot with purple from number three. Place that into slot two, pick up the green from number four, make your second right hand double knot. Place the green into number three, pick up the orange from number five, make another right hand double knot. Place the orange into four, blue into number five. Now you're gonna make the arrow going back the other way. Pick up number nine, which is blue. Make a left hand double knot with string number eight. Place that purple strand into number nine. Make another left hand double knot with string number seven, which is green. Place that green string into number eight. Pick up number six, which is orange. Make another left hand double knot. Place the orange string into number seven and then join your arrow, your five and six strands, which are both blue with a right hand double knot. Now we're gonna continue to make another open diamond in your totem pole pattern. You're gonna take your purple strand from slot two and make two right hand double knots. One with the green string from number three. Place that green into number two second right hand double knot with the orange string from slot number four. Orange will go into number three, purple string into number four. Now you're going to make one right hand double knot with your green string from slot two with string number three which is orange. Your orange string will go into number two, green string into slot number three. Now you're going to take string four which is purple and make two left hand double knots. One with string three, which should be green. Place that green string into number four. Pick up number two and make another left hand double knot. Orange will go into number three, purple into number two. Now you're gonna take string five, which is blue, and make three left hand double knots. One with the green string from slot four second one with the orange string from slot three. Pull through once. A second time, put the orange into number four, pick up number two, which is purple. Make your third left hand double knot. Purple string will go on slot three, blue string into slot two. Now we're gonna work on the other side. You're gonna take your purple string from number nine and make two left hand double knots. One with string eight, which is green. Place that green string in slot nine, pick up number seven, which is orange. Make your second left hand double knot. Orange will go into number eight, purple into seven. Now you're gonna take green again, which is string nine, and make a left hand double knot with string number eight, which is orange. Orange string into slot nine, 
green string into slot eight. Now you're gonna take your purple strand from slot seven and make two right hand double knots. One with string eight, pull through once, twice, put the green string in number seven, pick up number nine, which is orange, make your second right hand double knot. Orange will go into number eight, purple into number nine. Now you're gonna take string number six, which should be blue, and make three right hand double knots. One on your green string, once, pull through a second time. Green will go into number six, pick up number eight, which is orange, make your second right hand double knot. Put the orange into number seven, pick up your purple, and make your third right hand double knot. Now again, we're gonna close up this open diamond. You're gonna take the light blue from number two, and make three right hand double knots. First one with the purple string from slot three. Remember not to pull these too tight. Putting on the purple into number two, pick up four, uh, that's an orange string. Make your second right hand double knot. Not too tight. Place the orange string into slot three. Pick up number five, which is green, and make your third right hand double knot. Remember, don't pull too tight. Pull through once, twice, green string into slot four, blue string into slot five. Now we're gonna do the other side. Take string number nine, which is blue, make a left hand double knot with the purple string from slot eight. Put that purple string into number nine, pick up number seven, make a left hand double knot. Remember, keep these kind of loose. Pull through a second time. Orange will go into number eight. Pick up number six, which is green. Make your third left hand double knot. And now you're gonna join your center two blue strands, number five and six, to close up your diamond. This now completes your pattern. This time I'm gonna go step by step through the written instructions. You're gonna start with step number six, which is making an arrow with your purple strands. So you're gonna take string number two, make a right hand double knot with string number three, which is orange. Place that orange string in slot two, pick up the green from number four, make another right hand double knot. Place that green string in slot three, pick up number five, which is blue. Make another right hand double knot. Blue string will go in slot four, purple into slot five. Now you're gonna make your arrow coming back in, pick up number nine, which is purple, make a left hand double knot with string number eight, place the orange into slot nine, pick up number seven, make another left hand double knot, place that green string in slot eight, pick up number six, which is blue, make another left hand double knot, place that blue strand in slot seven, now you're gonna take strings five and six and make a right hand double knot and this will complete your arrow. Now you're gonna move on to step seven. You're gonna take string number two, which is orange, and make two right hand double knots. One with string number three, which is green. Place that green string in slot two and a second one with the blue string from slot four. Blue string will go into slot three orange string into slot four. Step eight, you're gonna take string number two, which is now green, and make a right hand double knot with string three, which is blue. Pull through once, twice, put your blue strand into number two, green string into slot number three. Now you're gonna move on to step number nine. You're gonna take string number four, which is orange, and make two left hand double knots. And pull through once, second time with string three, which was green, place that into slot four. Make your second left hand double knot with string number two, which is blue. Place the blue string into slot three, orange string into slot two. Now we're gonna move on to step number 10. You're gonna take purple string from slot number five and make three left hand double knots. The first one with string four, which should be green, that green string will go into number five. Pick up number three, which is blue. Make your second left hand double knot. Blue string will go into number four. Pick up number two, which is orange. 
make your third left hand double knot. Your orange string will go into slot three, your purple string into slot two. Step 11, you're gonna take your orange string from number nine and make two left hand double knots. One with string number eight, which is green. Place that green string into slot nine and your second left hand double knot with string seven, which is blue. Blue string will go into slot eight, orange string into slot seven. Now you're gonna do step number 12. You're gonna take string number nine, which should now be green, and make a left hand double knot with string eight, which should be blue. Pull through once, twice, blue string into slot nine, green string into slot eight. Step 13, you're gonna take string number seven, which is orange, and make two right hand double knots. One with the green string from slot number eight, green string into number seven, pick up number nine, which is blue, make your second right hand double knot. The blue string will go into slot eight, your orange string into slot nine. Step 14, you're gonna take your string number six, which is purple, and make three right hand double knots. Once with the green string from slot seven. Green string will go into slot six, pick up the blue from number eight, make your second right hand double knot. Blue string into slot seven, pick up number nine, which is orange, and make your third right hand double knot. Orange will go into number eight, purple into number nine. Now we're gonna work on closing the center of your diamond, which is now step number 15. You're gonna take string number two, which is purple, and make three right hand double knots. One with string three, which is orange. Place the orange string in slot two. A second one with number four, which is blue. Remember, don't make these knots real tight. Place the blue string in number three, pick up number five, and make your third right hand double knot. Remember to keep some space in between there. The green string will go in slot four, purple string into slot five. Now you're gonna do step 16. You're gonna take the purple string from slot nine and make three left hand double knots. Once with your orange string from slot eight, and place that orange into number nine, pick up number seven, which is blue, Remember to keep these kind of loose. Make your second left hand double knot. Place the blue into number eight. Pick up the green from six. And make your third left hand double knot. You're gonna place the green string into slot seven. And your purple string will go into slot six. Step 17, you're gonna take strings five and six, which are both purple. And you're gonna close your open diamond with a right hand double knot place those two strings back into the center slots. Now step number 18, you're gonna make an arrow with your string number two, which is orange. So you're gonna make a right hand double knot with string three, which is blue. Blue's gonna go into number two, pick up number four, which is green, make another right hand double knot. Green will go into number three, pick up number five, which is purple, make another right hand double knot. Purple will go in number four, orange into number five. Now you're gonna make your arrow working back in. Pick up the orange from number nine and make a left hand double knot with string eight, which is blue. The blue string will go into number nine. Pick up number seven, which is green. Make another left hand double knot. Place that green string into slot eight. Pick up number six, which is purple. Make another left hand double knot. Put the purple string into number seven, and then you're gonna join your center strands, five and six, to complete your arrow. Now we're gonna move on to step number 19. You're gonna take string number two and make two right hand double knots. One with string three, which is green. Place that green string into slot two, and a second right hand double knot with string four, which is purple. Place the purple string into slot three, the blue string into slot four. Step 20, you're gonna take string two, which should now be green, and make one right hand double knot with a purple strand from slot number three. Place the purple into number two, the green string into number three. Now you're gonna take 
your string number four, which is blue, and make two left hand double knots. This is step number 21. Make your first one with string number three, which was green. And make your second left hand double knot with string number two, which is purple. Place that purple string into slot three, blue string into slot two. Now you're gonna do step number 22. You're gonna take string number five, which is orange, and make three left hand double knots. The first one with the green string from slot four. Place that green string in slot number five, pick up number three, which is purple. Make your second left hand double knot. Purple string will go in slot four, pick up number two, which is blue. Make your third left hand double knot. Blue string will go into slot three, orange string into slot two. Now you're gonna move to the other side. It's gonna be step number 23. Take string number nine, which is blue, and make two left hand double knots. First one with string eight, which is green. Place that green string into number nine, pick up number seven, which is purple. Make a second left hand double knot. Purple string will go on slot eight, blue string into slot seven. Now you're at step number 24. You're gonna take the green string from number nine and make a left hand double knot with string number eight, which is purple. Purple string will go on slot number nine, green string into slot number eight. Step 25, you're gonna take your blue string from slot number seven and make two right hand double knots. One with string eight, which is green. Green string will go on slot seven, make your second right hand double knot with string number nine, which was purple. Purple string will go in slot eight, blue string into slot nine. Step 26, you're gonna take your orange string from slot number six and make three right hand double knots. One with your green string from slot seven. Green will go into number six, your second right hand double knot with string number eight, which is purple. Place the purple string into slot seven, pick up the blue from number nine and make your third right hand double knot. Blue will go in slot eight, orange will go into slot number nine. Step 27, you're actually gonna close up your diamond. You're gonna take string number two, which is orange, and make three right hand double knots. First one with string three, which was blue. Place that blue string into slot two, pick up number four, which is purple. Make your second right hand double knot. Remember to make these kind of loose. Put that purple string into number three, pick up number five, which is green. Make your third right hand double knot. Green string will go in slot four, orange string in slot five. Now you're gonna do step number 28. I'm gonna do the other side. You're gonna take your orange string from slot nine, make a left hand double knot with string eight, which is blue. Place that blue string into slot nine, make your second left hand double knot with the purple string from slot seven. Place that string into slot eight, pick up number six, which is green. Make your third left hand double knot. Remember to keep a little bit of space in between here. Green string will go into slot seven, orange string into slot six. Step 29, you're gonna join your center two strands, which should both be orange, with a right hand double knot. And this will close up your diamond and place your center two strands, the orange strands, back in your two slots. Now you're gonna move on to step number 30, and you're gonna make an arrow like we did before, but now with your blue strands. So you're gonna make a right hand double knot with string three, which is purple. Place that into number two, pick up the green from number four, make another right hand double knot. Place that green string in slot three, pick up number five, which is orange. Another right hand double knot. Orange will go in four, blue into number five. Now you're gonna make your arrow going back the other way. Pick up number nine, which should be blue. Make a left hand double knot with string eight, which is purple. Place that purple string into slot nine. Pick up the green from number seven. Make another left hand double knot. Place that green string in slot eight. Take number six, which is orange. Make another left hand double knot. Place the orange string in slot number seven. Now you're gonna join five and six with a right hand double knot to complete your arrow. 
Now you're gonna move on to step number 31. You're gonna take string number two, which is purple, and make two right hand double knots. One with string three, which is green. Place that green string in slot two. A second right hand double knot with the orange string from slot four. Orange will go in slot three, purple into slot four. Step 32, you're gonna take your green string from number two and make a right hand double knot with string three, which is orange. Place the orange string in slot two, the green string in slot three. Step 33, you're gonna take your purple string from slot four and make two left hand double knots. One with string three, which is green. Place that into number four, pick up number two and make your second left hand double knot with the orange strand. Orange will go into number three, purple into number two. Now you're gonna do step number 34. You're gonna take your blue string from number five and make three left hand double knots. One on string four, which should be green. Place that green string in slot five, pick up number three, which is orange. Make your second left hand double knot. Place that orange in number four, pick up number two, which is purple. Make your third left hand double knot. Purple strand will go in slot three. Your blue strand will go into slot two. Now you're gonna move to the other side. This is gonna be step number 35. You're gonna take string number nine, which is purple, and make two left hand double knots. One on the green string from slot eight. Place that green string in number nine. Second left hand double knot with the orange string from slot seven. Orange will go in number eight, purple into number seven. Step 36, you're gonna take the green string from slot nine and make a left hand double knot with the orange string from number eight. The orange string will go in slot nine, green string into slot eight. Step 37, you're gonna take string number seven, which should be purple, and make two right hand double knots. One with the green string from slot eight, place that green string into slot seven, and a second right hand double knot with string nine, which is orange. The orange string will go in slot eight, the purple string into slot nine. Now you're gonna take string number six, which is blue, and make three right hand double knots. This is step number 38. First one with the green string from slot seven, place that green into number six, pick up number eight, which is orange, make your second right hand double knot, Orange will go into number seven, pick up the purple, and make your third left hand double knot. Purple will go into slot eight, blue into slot number nine. Now we're gonna move on to step number 39, which is gonna be closing your open diamond shape. You're gonna take string number two, which is blue, and make three right hand double knots. Pull through once, twice on the purple strand, Pick up the orange, make your second right hand double knot. Remember these you don't wanna to make too tight. Put the orange into number three, pick up number five, which is green. Make your third right hand double knot. Remember to leave some space. Green will go in number four, blue into number five. Now we're gonna do step 40, which is taking the blue from number nine and making three left hand double knots. One with your string eight, which was purple, place that in number nine, pick up seven, which is orange, make your second left hand double knot. Remember to leave some space here. Put the orange into slot eight, pick up the green from number six and make your third left hand double knot. The green string will go into slot seven, blue string into slot six. Now we're gonna take strings five and six, which should both be blue, and join them in the center with a right hand double knot. This is gonna be step 41, and your open diamond should be complete. This now completes your totem pole pattern. What I did at the end of my bracelet is I made a few arrows. Make a purple one, Pull through once, 
twice. Take your green, pull through once, twice. Take the blue, do that again. You're gonna take your purple from the other side, work your way backwards, pull through once, twice. Take your green, the blue, And then join your center two, like you did before, with a right hand double knot. And then I continued with an orange arrow, green, and blue. Once you've completed your arrows, you're going to take the strings from slots two, three, and four in your left hand, and the strings from seven, eight, and nine in your right hand. You're going to braid these with the center two strands from slots five and six. Now what you're going to do is you're going to make a knot over top of your braid right at the end of your bracelet. I'm going to do that one time and tie a second knot and try and get that as close to the other as you can, almost on top if it's possible. Once you've made your knots, take your bracelet from your bracelet maker and your bracelet's complete.